Hi, this is Aaron at Ag Easel Solutions. Today we're getting ready to do an install on a John Deere 8410. This tractor specifically has the 8.1 liter John Deere Powertech engine with the Bosch RE pump. Uh, the specific module for this application is the RE1000. Uh, this module will work on the 8.1 liter and 7.6 liter as well, as long as it has a Bosch RE pump. Uh, this is a very simple application. Uh, on this module we have four settings. We have stock, 10, 20, and 30 percent, uh, rather than having stock 15 and 30. Uh, very simple process. We'll go ahead and cover this. Our primary connectors are a male and female six pin connector. And depending on the application, it'll be on the right hand side of the engine part if it's on a tractor. So we'll go around. We're now on the pump side of this tractor. So we'll go over our key uh, locations where we'll be installing this harness. Uh, the harness here, unfortunately the hood doesn't raise up on this tractor, but the six pin connector is located just to the right of the oil filter, in between the oil filter and the pump. It has a single tab that releases this from the factory male portion of that uh, harness. And just to give an idea what that tab looks like, it looks like the same on our harness. So once that is removed, we will take the female portion of our harness and go to the male. Make sure that this uh, lock is on ramp side of the factory engine harness and it will plug in. And always remember when installing these to make sure that all connections click and snap and are secure. As you can see you heard that click. And we will now take the male portion of our harness to go to the female portion of the factory engine harness. And we'll run this up here. It's still relatively easy to get to. You can feel it. Just make sure that the lock and ramp are on the same side as earlier. As you can see, we heard that click too. So it's in there and it's secure. Now, good location for this module you can mount it right here on one of the fuel lines on the pump just in the area where it's not going to be damaged and it's got good air fluctuation that way the module doesn't get hot or if you want to tuck it up a little bit tighter you can tie it to the factory wiring harness up here behind this shield i want to thank this customer on another good purchase from a great module uh, always be sure to check out our youtube and facebook page and our website agdieselsolutions.com and always be sure to farm smart, farm efficient, farm with Ag Diesel Solutions. Thank you guys for joining us and have a great day.